Hello friends, Coolio here and welcome back to the channel. Today guys, we're going to be checking out the newest update to Battle Prime. This is their season 4 update and it is a huge game changer, okay? So I've played this game in the past and I almost made a video on it kind of a long time ago when it came out. I think it was about 6 months ago. However, I did not enjoy the game at all. I felt the gameplay was really, really slow. I hated the UI. I hated the progression system. However, everything has been massively improved in this new update. If you've been even thinking or considering even checking this game out, then this right now, this update is probably the time that you guys should check it out because there is a huge list, like a massive list of changes that they've made into the game. Now, this is a game that I've been kind of keeping my eye out on ever since it first came out because I thought it could be a really, really great game. And honestly, like, I think it's there. Now, if you guys head on over to their Facebook page, they have a huge list of all the different changes that have come into the game. Now, I'm not going to go through and talk about everything, but uh, one of the first things I'm going to talk about is for Season 4, they actually have two battle passes available. The first one is called the Dark Division, which will last for about another 28 days. And then after this one's done, they will release the Urban Wave Battle Pass. Now, this kind of leads me into my first thing that I think is a really, really great change that they've made to this battle pass is it only costs $5 rather than $10 like it was before. Now, in my personal opinion, when it comes to a battle pass, at least in a mobile game, $5 is a perfect price. Anything higher than that, I think is ridiculous. I don't think a mobile game should have a $10 battle pass. Even though I like battle passes, I think they're a really great way to monetize a game. I, I love the fact that this one's only $5 and I'm probably going to end up buying it because there are some pretty cool skins that you can get in it. And I'm really excited to see what the Urban Wave one looks like too because I do like the dark armor that you can get for several of the different characters. Now on top of the fact that they have this new, um, the new battle pass available, they also released a whole bunch of activities that you can do in the game. There are rookie rewards for simply just logging into the game, there's the basic training for new players, the weekend playlist, and the weekly contracts. You can get a lot of rewards in this game. And one of the things I absolutely hated about the game before was the fact that you had to gather keys in order to, you know, in order to open up their loot boxes. That's completely done with, it's gone. You basically just get the containers, the free loot boxes by playing through the game. I mean, you can buy them if you want with basic in-game currency or spend some premium currency, but it is strictly, strictly cosmetics. So if I head on over, let me see if I have one I can go and check out for you guys. Uh, the Vanguard Sentinel set. So this is everything that you can get in the Vanguard Sentinel set. It is skins. Great up skins, you guys. It's awesome. I love it. I think it's a fantastic idea that they they've pretty much done away with the pay to win in this game. It's strictly cosmetics. So that's fantastic. The other thing I want to talk about too, as well as they've added in a bunch of new social features. There's clans. Uh, you can squad up with people. They added in a new game mode, which is what we're going to be playing today. The skirmish game mode. Uh, they've updated the overall gameplay mechanics too. You can actually slide now. The movement is way better. It's just, it's been a massive improvement since the last time I played this game. Like, good job, Battle Prime. You guys are knocking it out of the park. I know I'm kind of gushing over the game. There's still some, you know, things that they can kind of fix. There's still like a little bit of a weird slowdown when I'm playing like, like on my phone or something like that. So hopefully they can improve optimization on other devices. But other than that, like, like I said, I've been having a blast with this game. It's tons of fun. So the new skirmish mode is a three versus three, nine rounds death match. If you die, you are completely out that round. And whoever ends up winning five rounds wins the game. So also after about 30 seconds, a flag will appear in the center of the map. If you haven't killed anyone, like if you kind of like going back and forth, you can go ahead and just like run and go grab the flag before the enemy team does. So here we go. Let's see if we can't win this. My last game that I played on this was freaking intense, so. Oh, what the heck? I thought I killed him. Dude, what is my teammate doing? Shoot him, shoot him. Oh my gosh. You guys, come on. And you just got stunned and you're going to die. Oh, yes, my teammates. Ugh. The last game I played, my teammates were not very good, so. This is, this is actually really interesting because I played on this map last time, okay? I played on this map last time. However, there's a we're playing on a different section of the map. And so the overall gameplay experience is way different. Oh 
my gosh, run! Guys, ah, frick! I would have gone for the headshot, freaking headshot, and I could have—I think I could have won that won that round. Gosh, freaking! Okay, here we go. I don't know where the enemy went. The scanners aren't picking them up. Oh, just 1v1. No, no! Gosh, take it! Ugh. Okay. Oh my gosh. Guys, I don't want to lose this. We're going to go in as shock. Where'd he go? Yes! Oh, oh my gosh. Okay, finally. Finally, we finally, finally, we got ourselves a victory. Can we make a comeback? I don't know, you guys. I honestly don't know. All right. Come on, teammates. We can do this. Icebox and player 7-inch. Yes. Oh my gosh, you guys. I'm going to make this comeback, okay? I'm going We are going to win this match. Dude, freaking trying to come around and like take me from behind? Forget it! I should have just started off as shock. I don't know why I picked the other person. Oh my gosh, you guys. If we win one more round, we win this skirmish match. I have a feeling one of their teammates might have, um, they might have AFK'd. That's what it feels like.
Oh my gosh, seriously? Ugh, crap. I should have backed up. I should have backed up. Oh. Okay, my teammates. Come on, you guys. I heard him. Where'd he go? We freaking did it. <laughs> oh my gosh, you guys. I love this new game mode. I think it's so much fun. Victory's ours. Obviously, I'm the MVP. I'm having an absolute blast with this game. Just the controls feel so much better. Everything just feels... Like they're making really, really good progress on this game. So if you guys enjoyed today's video, if you guys want to see more videos like this, then let me know down below in the comments. Again, like hit the like button. It helps out so much. Thank you so much, Coolio Crew, for all of your amazing support. And if you guys are playing this game, go ahead and add me as a friend. I'm Coolio, K-O-O-L-I-O. -O Only add me a friend. I would have an absolute blast with you guys. Guys, thanks so much for watching. Again, my name is Coolio, and I'll see you guys next time.